Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What are Tom Homan's views on sanctuary cities? Tom Homan, the former acting director of U.S. Immigration and Customs Enforcement, ICE, has expressed strong opinions about sanctuary cities. He believes these cities pose a significant threat to public safety and weaken federal immigration laws. Homan describes sanctuary cities as null and American null, arguing that their policies increase risks for both the public and law enforcement officers. He criticizes these cities for not working with federal immigration authorities, which he claims forces ICE agents to make arrests in communities instead of within the safer confines of jails. He points out that when ICE must arrest criminals in neighborhoods, it raises the likelihood of null collateral arrests, null, where other individuals in the country illegally may also be taken into custody. This situation, he argues, endangers both the community and the law enforcement officials involved. Homan contends that sanctuary policies do not protect immigrant communities as advocates suggest. Instead, he believes these policies shield criminals who are illegally residing in the country, putting victims at greater risk of repeat offenses. He has called for accountability for politicians who support sanctuary city policies, suggesting they should face legal consequences for not cooperating with federal immigration authorities. Homan advocates for withholding federal funding from these cities as a necessary step to enforce compliance. In his perspective, the lack of cooperation from sanctuary cities obstructs ICE's ability to operate safely and effectively. For example, in California, which has adopted sanctuary state laws, Homan noted that these regulations would compel ICE to conduct more at-large arrests, resulting in heightened risks and collateral arrests. Homan's position is clear. He views sanctuary cities as obstacles to effective immigration enforcement and a danger to public safety, calling for stronger measures to ensure adherence to federal laws. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.